close your eyes and find your breath. If you've been wandering around all day, all morning, it may take a little while. Actually, close your eyes, the breath is right there, but then you have to keep track of it. And that's what, what makes a difference. I mean, anybody can look at the breath for a few seconds, but to stay with it continually, that requires skill and determination. After all, happiness isn't something that just happens on its own. The times when we are happy and it just seems to be for no reason at all, it's the result of past actions. So we're going to make sure that the actions we do now are conducive to happiness. So we try to find the breath so we can find the mind. When we find the mind, then we see okay, where things are coming from. They're coming from your intentions. You want to be very careful about which tensions, intentions you act on. So the breath gives you a place of strength to stay so that you can resist the temptation to do things that you know are unskillful. And to do things that may be difficult but you know will lead to good results in the long run. Because that's what wisdom consists of. The Buddha said it start, starts with the question, what when I do it will lead to my long-term welfare and happiness. The wisdom is in seeing that happiness is going to depend on your actions and that long-term is better than short-term. If the mind is weak, or if it's got wrong views, or if it has right views but it's still weak, it's often hard to go for the long term. We go for the short term. A little bit right now, right now. Please, a little bit right now. That's what the mind keeps saying. And you need the strength to say, okay, here's a better happiness, a better pleasure that we can create by being with the breath. That helps to sustain you during periods when it's difficult. So look to the breath for sustenance, because it sustains not only the, the body, but it sustains the well-being of the mind, if you know how to use it. But the first thing that's required is learning how to keep track of it. As they used to say in that commercial, it's, it's 9 o'clock, where is your mind right? Do you know where your mind is right now? Do you know where your breath is right now? Okay, keep the two of them together. And both will benefit.